Hi, I'm Dr. Shari Ahmed. Uh, today I'm going to present about pulmonary embolism regarding AMC. First, started with the learning objectives. Uh, you need to uh, see some specific history, clinical features, investigations. Uh, importantly initial investigation best investigation differential diagnosis and management those are asked in AMC so often okay next it's very important to see uh, you will find a case uh, where there will be a long travel history or maybe a surgery patient may often present it with chest pain and respiratory difficulty and tachycardia you need to do an ECG or chest x-ray see here the confirmatory test CTPA is gold standard what to do during pregnancy and renal impairment for renal impairment the initial tests are the same but the best test is not CTPA because it's nephrotoxic you also need to do this, the test also for pregnancy the answers are a bit different you need to do D dimer at a point but if fast base is always the CTPA now some managements you need to start with oxygen and those things followed by the heparin and later on the warfarin see the warfarin at the third day and you need to continue that one at least for six months maintaining the INR between 2 to 3 or 2.5 to 2.3 also you need to know when to apply IVC filter yes if you have a documented different thrombosis in the lower extremity you need to give IVC filter to save the patient uh, this is a case of warfarin induced skin necrosis can happen in a rare case and thus all from the presentation